Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Championship Sunday. Denial find themselves one map away from knocking out FaZe and progressing through. And this Denial squad is looking so, so dominant right now. Composed. The communication was there. great there. That uplink that we listened to. Game number four is going to be a hard point, though. It's going to be Solar. The one we've seen online through the Pro League. The second half of Advanced Warfare, Zuma actually dominate. Yep. Play fits his play style well, but don't discount Slasher and Temp. Temp going to run the AR probably. Temp have seen what he was doing with the AR when he was on Elevate before. He could be a difference maker in this. He really could. We'll wait and see exactly the loadout that they're going to run. But when it comes to Solo, historically it was one of FaZe's better maps. But yep. their hard point in this event has not been good. Let's be completely honest. I think, honestly, this is where FaZe crash out the tournament. I don't, and I don't think it's through. the event they've been bad. I think the the last few hard points we've seen them play. No, every every single time I've casted them, they've looked really shaky in hard point. It's been a weird one. Fair enough. Them. You're going to have a, a three bow set up from both teams. You're going to have Temp Classic and Slasher. The bow's on. Denial, and then on the other side, I believe it's going to be Zuma running the ASM1, so they're going to put the bow in attached hands. Play step. Off to a pretty decent start. Two kills already as he tries to hunt down Hook, who was on that hard point. Instantly falls after picking up that kill, though. And now with it, nice early break and start. Unable to hold it for too long, as expected, of course. First hard point on Solar can be very scrappy, but early on, really not too much going on. Zuma's going to fall as well. Lots of trading currently on this hard point. I'm interested to see the battle of the SMGs, right? Zuma's going to be in your face, aggressive on this map. And Hook. Because he plays such a vertical style of play, you know, just up in the air all the time, he's really hard to pinpoint and get down with the balance map. He's definitely very good with the SMG. Be interesting who comes out on top of that matchup. Oh, Clay. <laughs> just picks off Slasher. Close and personal with the bow. And Denal, so far with the 11-point lead, Slasher's going to be at the back, and Clay finds him again off spawn. Now Clay fighting for the spawn point. He's going to get shredded through from Hook, who just kind of Played that one so they, smart. They have Wade. negated Clay though. Clay is always in position to rotate for the spawns. You know, like I was too, one of the best anchors, the best ARs in Call of Duty history. He picks up one. They have three players right there to converge on him to take mm -hmm. him out before he's able to control spawns for phase. So smart plays out of denial. Right now, this is all denial. They are locking it down. Let's take a look over at Slasher. Currently sitting at seven and six. Gonna throw out a couple of stun grenades. Phase do have favorable spawns, but no problem for Slasher as he picks up the first. Can he find Clay? Yes, he can. Two in quick succession for him. Now over to Temp. Has the ASM one out for this hard point. Will fall. Right now, they have built themselves the score a pretty is heavily lopsided lead. in favor of Denial. I mean, you're going to see the rotation come in to the next hill. It looks like Denial's actually able to control this one here early. So Denial's just outplaying phase, phase right phase now. is just not rotating properly. I mean, Clay goes up top, but he has no teammate support in the last one. Now, nobody rotates early at all. You see bad shots coming in from attached, but they can get this close, Ben, going into the second half of the game. And Nabel started off, I believe, it was 2-7. and seven. You don't think he's going to carry on at that pace for the rest of the game. Right now, if you're phased, you can't really pay attention to the score. I mean, obviously, you can't fall too far behind. But your goal is to get it within 10 to 15 points going into the second half. Phase finally breaking to the hard point with 30 seconds remaining. And Temp just kind of says, well, no, I don't think so, guys. This is mine. <laughs> Tries to find two. Slasher should be in a position to trade. Does so. Slasher having a phenomenal game. Struggled in the set to destroy early on. But that's 15 and 9. Three kills. He's just I having his own way with Phase right it's now. It's just, it's mind boggling to me. Because yesterday I watched Elevate against Denial. Mm -hmm. And I didn't see this. I didn't see this Denial. They go 16 on map count. They lose to Elevate. And now they come in here and they are playing like they're like the 16 and 0 denial, just a really weird sequence of events. 100 points to just 32, the current lead for denial. Absolute beautiful play off that first side. Slasher leading the way with the bow, looking for his 20th kill, gets it. Slasher is having some fun with this one, that's for sure. Just completely having his way with FaZe and Abel so slow. Double negative at 7 and 14. Clayster struggling as well at 8 and 13, which is so strange because both the assault rifle plays in the first half point, if you remember, played so well. When now, Clay, roles are basically just switched. When Clay struggles, it's going to be hard for FaZe to win because he's the one playing for those spawns. And yep. 
what it looks like Denial's doing, putting two or three players on rotation, really they're just negating. Stacking yeah, they're just stacking it on rotation. That's something towards the end of Black Ops 2 we saw happen a lot. You know, yep. Earlier, it was one guy on the anchor. Same thing with Advanced Warfare, and now we're starting to see, nope, two, three players on the rotation. And FaZe needs to adjust in the second half, Ben, or else it's going to be a blowout. I mean, I honestly think this is going to be a blowout with the way Slasher is playing right now. Hoop's going to fall, but Classic going to pick up the scrap time over towards this next hard point. The final one of the first rotation. Uh, it just seems as if FaZe can't get things going. Zuma finally started heat up. That's two in a row. Can he find the third? It's going to be Slasher. This could be a little bit of a momentum for him as he finds his 20th kill of the game. Slasher's going to be at the back as well. Has him one shot, not able to pick up the kill, but recognizes he's going to be pinched. Just no support whatsoever for FaZe. There's nobody there to fly in and trade right away. That's what you usually saw at a FaZe when it's attached fighting in the hill. He dies, it's Zuma flies right in the hill, picks up one or two, and then pushes out the spawns, and vice versa. We just haven't seen that in the last few hardpoint games, but the sport is getting closer, Ben. They're chipping away at it. They win Garage and up top this next hill, and they don't give up chunks of time on the first two. They can't right. afford to do that again. You know, they gave up a ton of time to Denal first go around on this first hard point. The comeback is definitely on, Matt. If, if they don't give up a ton of time here, they split time, you know, maybe. Phase takes an extra 10 seconds. They make this a 122 to, you know, let's say it's, it goes into the second hill and it's, for argument's sake, 140 to 120. I think Phase can definitely bring it back. Well, they are starting to find the shots, that's for sure. Enable extends to a three streak now, and the deficit being reduced down to around about 20 points with four minutes and a half still to go. Classic attempt though, dive onto the hard point, desperate to build that lead back. Classic's gonna go down. Hoop should be in a position to trade. Has Slasher in support. Slasher jumps away as he tries to get some control over glass. He falls. Temp though, straight back onto the hard point, burst back out with that bow, looking to pick up the kill on enable. Not gonna be able to do so. Meanwhile, Classic, he's just sitting on the hard point map, picking up some free time. Ben, I feel like this is the turning point of the game. You know, you see Denal in the middle, hard point, picking up some time. I wanna go to Turtle Beach team chat with FaZe, arguably the best team throughout all of Advanced Warfare. Their tournament lives are on the line. Okay, stop. Okay, let's go around. So let's go around right there. We have to play this one. I spawn pipe. I spawn pipe. We're fine. We're playing Tamba. Top boy pipe. I got him. Yeah. One more next hill. Next hill. I, let's I just go through. Let's go through. Let's go through. Yo, he's maps, guys. Two maps. 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 Two I spawned, I'm gonna spawn Yeah, two in maps, two maps, two maps, guys. I'm in top end. I need someone to One in hill. Top maps, top maps, two there. I got one, 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 top maps, top maps, guys, top maps. I'm going around. Top maps, top maps, top maps. I spawned in, I spawned in. There's an in top maps, guys. Mass street, mass street, mass street. Top maps, yo, he's rails, rails, let's go. In hill, in hill, in hill. In maps, in maps, in maps. They're gonna be up top. Back maps, weak, back maps, weak. Top maps, top maps. I got one, no one, top maps. I killed one of guys, top maps. Yellow cat, yellow cat. They're live, they one more cut, rail. Nice, let's go. Rail, rail, two rail, two rail, two rail, two rail. Go, cut, cut, big cut. Cut, cut, cut. I'm up to the whole rotation. I'll push this hill, I'll push this hill. Yo, I have a lot. I'm trying to hold a lot as best I can. Purple cat, jumping in steam. Tim, one shot, all two. Yo, they're coming out wall. I'm trying to hold this hill. S1 glass tree, S1 glass tree, guys. Yo, one to two, I think. Yo, two. He gave me the jump. Top round, top round. Top round, one shot. Top round, one shot. Let's go, let's go. Look at big door, look at big door. I got big door. I'm steam, I'm steam right now. Where they at, guys? I'm looking at big door. It could be out wall. Oh, I don't see anyone help you, Dylan. I got one. Yo, top team, top team. I got him. Let's go. Stay no. Yeah. One more tool, tool or something. Tool. Yeah. Watch, watch. Yo, L1, 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 L1. Two L1, two L1. Watch, watch, watch. I got one. Let's go. I got one. Let's go. I'll push you up to top team. I have you, L1. I have L1. I'm going brown. I'm going brown. Are you sure they're all fan? I got rail. Yo, top team, top team. Jumping down. Two top team. One coming mid alley. One out. Yo, L1, 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 L1. Two out, two out, two out. I spawned out. I spawned out. Yo, I spawned out. I spawned out. I spawned out. I spawned out. It's tool, it's tool, one out the door, one out the door. Yo, two, two, two. Work this now, guys. Yeah, yeah. He's in there, he's in there. He's one in there, big door, big door, big door, big door. Bigger one shot, bigger one shot, bigger one shot. Let's go, let's two, let's go. Let's go, so. Weak, weak, one shot. Rotate, 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 we're fine, rotate. Yeah, one map. He's on map, he's on map, he's on map. Did you get him? Yeah, he's one shot. He's one shot. He's one shot, he's one shot. He's one shot, he's one shot. And they're both on it, nice, don't worry. Ten, we stay on somewhere. We spawned out all the way out, go big. Yo, in maps, in maps. Who's in maps, who's in maps, who's in maps. P1, P1, turn down to P1, no one push me up. Mass, two one shot, classic, classic in hill, one shot. Classic is 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 in hill, one shot. He wants one shot. Aim back up, aim back up, aim back up. He's back up. Yo, he's back up. I got him, another one's dead. Glass, glass, two glass, dub, dub. One shot, one shot. Mass, 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 mass. 
Hey, oh, you got behind us. Behind us. I'm 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 I'm behind us. 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 I'm Let's go, I'm going out right, yeah, 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 rotate, rotate. We're down. We're, we're, we're gonna be down by street. 10. Bottom rails, they spawn bottom rails. Both one shot, both of them one shot. Challenging you. Challenging you. Open pipe, open pipe. Right, I'm 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 guys, they're looking for me middle, guys. They're looking for me middle. Yo, two people, two people, two people. Let's get through. One shot, one shot, one shot. I can't challenge, I can't challenge. I'm just, he's in the left corner. It's one shot, he's one shot. I got him. I'm in the middle, I'm in the middle. Yo, they're nade, they're nade, they're nade, they're nade. Bounce, bounce, double bounce, put ring, 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 ring. Bounce, 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 I spawned the back. That's one. Balcony, one's on balcony, one in hill. We gotta go down. I'm Steve, I'm Steve. There's two on balcony. Go, go, go. I'm in up, I'm in up, I'm in up. One's balcony, one's balcony. Two balcony, that's right. Yo, he's in hill, he's in hill, he's in hill. I got the ring, go, go, get in hill, get in hill. Dude, they're front, they're front, they're front. Denial, shut down phase in the final couple of hard points. Beautiful play from them. Hoop goes 40 and 38. Slasher steps up as well. 39 and 38 for him. An unbelievable performance from Denial. The movement verticality of Hook with the pressure of the ASM1. Not a blowout, Ben. Barely holds Bro. on here. It's going to be Denial taking this series of first phase. Two juggernauts just going at it. This series could have went either way. Oh, that's a tough way for phase to go out, though. Yeah, you can see the disappointment on their faces, which means uh, we won't get that Ultra Gaming phase final, which a lot of people were anticipating. But uh, you could hear the communication as well from them. It was, it was good, but Matt, where, where did that really go wrong? What, what happened? You know, they had Garage Hill for a while, and I think you heard it was enabled during the team chat, mm -hmm. saying we got to rotate up top. You looked on the mini-map, there's two players for phase, both on either side. Everyone for denial rotated up top. They won that top hill. And even after, you know, phase, they started exchanging some kills back and forth, but they ended up split spawning denial out, ended up resulting in them just keep pinching over and over again. Nobody really got any time there in just a... Last second win. I mean, you thought for a second that Faye was going to make a comeback at the end, but Look close, not enough. But it just wasn't enough. Congratulations to Denial progressing through that loser's bracket. Let's try and get our thoughts from our analyst desk. Puckett, over to you. All right, thank you guys. Jack, let's start it off with you, my friend. I was talking to Contry in the front. Yep. A lot of excitement here. We were talking about, are we going to see Faze versus Optic Gaming? We know that's not going to happen. Why didn't things work out for Faze? Let's start with game one. I mean, really, it's something that we've talked a lot about FaZe throughout a lot of their matches we've seen at these recent tournaments. And it just seems like sometimes they have slow starts. It happened in both hard points of this game where they really didn't get off to that burst of energy that you think from this FaZe team. Clayster just wasn't warmed up. He began to heat up at the end of that game. You saw the three kills in garages. He began to rotate 34-25 at one point. But the first half of both hard points was completely dominated by the ARs of Denial. And then when Hook is continually shutting down Zuma in that submachine gun role, that's where FaZe really struggled. Obviously, Zuma pulling the AR out a little bit more in that matchup. FaZe at one point was running three ARs, especially in that top lot hill, but it just wasn't enough. Too big of a de deficit going into that final hard point. Chance, what did you see from FaZe, though, in that search and destroy? And, and what went wrong for Denial towards the end of that one? Very back and forth the entire time in S&D, as is expected with like the juggernaut of teams, but FaZe, they were able to clutch up when they needed to. They're, the first play that stands out of my mind, Classic was in the one versus two, he gets the kill on the bomb planter, then I think it was Zuma, but somehow gets the kill and then defuses it with yeah. basically no time left on the clock. So that's right. the first huge clutch play. You know, both sides came out, but FaZe came out on top of that one. Then the 1v2 from Clayster, that was just an absolutely gargantuan play. I still have no idea how he was able to escape that alive. He right. had both players just screaming at him in front of him, Somehow killed one, got one shot, and then got away. Temp hopped right on bomb. Uh, you know, it's a 50-50 shot. It just didn't work out. But again, back and forth game. Phase, they were just a little bit more clutch. Uplink, you saw that one. Go back over to Denial as well. Great job point. by Hook and the boys. Throwing it on top of the roof in the final minute. But it came down to the kill from Slasher for me. You saw the final minute. Slasher, only one behind enemy lines. He gets the kill, stops the drone movement. They're able to go for the play ball. And really, you have to say classic. Great addition to this oh, yeah. denial squad. I thought he played lights out some major kills with the ASM one throughout game three. Oh yeah, and big thing to point out too, in this match, FaZe, the team that was so dominant in respawn game modes, losing the three respawns in this one, 
that's really going to do it for them. Their, their AW is over, and, and it's kind of crazy to say. I know that if FaZe won this one, it would have been the big talks, you know. FaZe or Optic, which was the bigger team, obviously, in Advanced Warfare. Optic still in it. Winner's Bracket Finals. Guaranteed will be top coming up three. Soon exactly. You got to start to think, you know, Optic, outside of that rough champs, they've kind of been near the top through all of AW, always something to look out for in this match. So we're not going to get the Optic Gaming phase matchup, but I'm excited to see how far Denial is going to go. And there's one player that I think is a little especially happy after that win. You got to look at Slasher, man. Yeah. Booted off of his squad. He wore the phase jersey most of this year, won a championship with him to open up the year back at the Columbus Open. Now wearing that Denial jersey, and he made it look good in that final game, Chance. He was absolutely getting hype. He was screaming his He picked up a two-piece and started losing <laughs> his mind. I think at one point he was like 17 and 10, but early on he was carrying in that hard point, playing absolutely phenomenally, finished on top of the scoreboard as well, at least in terms of kills for a squad. So he clutched up when he needed to. They're going to move on. They're looking good. And something even Mr. X brought up in that final hard point, there was a situation where on that last parking lot hill, their second to last hill, excuse me, there were two splits, two players on phase at the last hill, two at the very front pushing up. Clayster picked up three in that garage hill, right. fighting for five seconds of scrap. If he had died, he would have spawned up with his teammates, but he ended up staying alive, and then his teammate, I'm pretty sure it was Zuma, spawned up on him, yeah. and then they got a trek all the way across the map. So as weird as it is to say, Clayster got too many kills towards the end there. <laughs> it, it really took me back to that moment. You saw Karma and BL fire back yeah. in Black Ops 2. Neither player wanting to kill each other because they know the hard points exactly. moving. Clay, so tough to recognize. excellent shots. Bad timing there, and honestly, they were able to regain the hard point for yeah. a moment, but Denial just never ceased on the pressure. I love the energy they brought behind Hook. Oh, exactly, and that's what you expect from this Denial team. I just, I, I, I tweeted, Hook is one of my favorite players to watch at all times. It just seems like he never has a bad game. If he finishes negative, that's, that's already a big enough, like, whoa, what was wrong with Hook that game? But still, he's making the biggest impact on his team, it feels like, at all times. And then, once again, classic, in that AR role, now with with joining um, Slasher on that team, fits in so well. Denial, they got a chance at this thing, man. I, I don't want anyone to uh, think that they're out of this at any means. Who can tempt? They missed out on the million dollar tournament. They're still fighting for the biggest piece of the $250,000 prize. Well, that's enough from us here at the analyst desk. We'll see you with more Call of Duty live here from New Orleans on the other side of the break.